and I am back uh, with this clear bag. We always know what that means. I took out one of the items so I could start off my video by showing it. Um, I hope if you're having a great day, I want you to go ahead and subscribe. If you would, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and hit that notification bell so you will be notified when I do post a video. And go ahead and share with all your friends and families. It is free. If you're new here, I do different haul videos of different places like Walmart, Gabe's, Dollar Tree, Goodwill, etc. Um, hopefully to get into some other contents eventually. Um, but if you haven't already subscribed, please, please, please do so. But let's go ahead and get into this haul. Let me show you what I got. Um, first off, I picked up, and this is just from my local Goodwill. I go there right often. They have some great finds. I thought this was cute. This is good to be a princess. And this could be a little um, Halloween basket if you want to use it for Halloween. Or it could be an Easter basket. I just thought it was cute. We have a toy bin. Most Goodwills probably do have a toy bin. And it was $0.50 cent in that bin. So I did pick that up. And I thought it was this darling. I picked up this little play snake. You see that? I picked him up. Um, just a green play snake. And can you hear it? It's a rattlesnake. So I picked him up for 50 cent at the toy bin. The next thing I picked up was these cute little shoes. How darling are they? These are super cute. And most of the time you get these in the store, they're like $9.99. And usually a little purse comes with it. Um, but I thought these was cute. And these from Anna and Elsa from Frozen. Everybody knows who Frozen is. So this is, I think this is Elsa. I think that's who it is. I'm not sure. I could be wrong. This could be a Disney princess. Yeah, I think that's what this is, Disney. So I thought they were cute. So they were 50 cent. I picked up this Halloween um, glow in the dark. When you're out trick or treat, you press the button. See that? And it was regular $4.99. Light up and spin. I got it for 50 cent. How great is that? 50 cent. Next thing I picked up was this baby doll. And this is uh, the Grow With Me um, Baby Alive. Um, she's supposed to grow like her hair grows. I'm sure um, whoever got her is already grew. She started off as an infant, but their hair grows out longer and her eyes and stuff open. But she does take some batteries that I'm going to have to put in here in her back. Yeah, she has batteries. You open it up here at the bottom and put batteries in her. So I'm going to give her a good wash down and um, clean her up and see what she does. I got her for 50 cents. I picked up this container. This is for a freezer. You could put ice cream or whatever in. It says freezer. Um, freezerettes, that's what it's called. I got it for 59 cents. And you just screw the top on, so I thought that was very cute. So I picked that up. And I got these nice little baskets. Um, these baskets are really cute. I got all three of these. Um, I'm thinking 50 cent or maybe a dollar. The ticket's off of it. But you get three baskets. You see I got a red, a gray one, and a blue one. All three of those baskets there. And I thought these would be nice to put um, a napkin in or some wax paper or something. If you have the muffins or stuffing or dinner rolls or even at a um, cookout if you want to lay some condiments and stuff in there like if you got packs of mustard or ketchup or um just anything you want to put in if you want to put um snacks in here for the kids like nabs and little stuff like that you can put in there for children um little fruit snacks it's just it's a variety of things that you can do so i thought this would be nice for some of the family functions that we have it would be a great thing to have and the next thing i got let me is there something else in this bag I don't like something's in his back. I'm shaking it, trying to see. Oh, the little hand sanitizer that goes on the little baby doll. It's just a little hand sanitizer. You open it up, put stuff in it. Um, I think it was hanging on the baby doll's wrist here. So, let's get another bag up here on the couch. Or a sofa. I'm very, I'm rather, I'm southern, huh, if I say couch. <laughs> sofa. 
So, I picked up this lunch bag. This is Igloo. How nice is that? Love this color. It zips. It's green. Um, I like it. It's, it's a squared shape. If you can see that shape, it's squared. And it just zips up. And it is the green and black. And it has the strap here. That you can adjust your strap. And guess what? Igloo. And look how much I got this for. Let me see what the sticker says. Can we see that? 99 cent. Y'all see that? 99 cent is what I paid for that. I got this in the toy bin as well. Um, Layla likes to play doctor here lately. So I thought this was very cute for her. So I picked this up. Um, just a little doctor stethoscope. So I thought that was cute. So I got that for her. I picked this up for my cousin. She likes red skins. So I thought she would like this. It was only 50 cents. So I thought she would like to put this in her car or set it on her dresser in her room. But she's a red skins fan. But for 50 cents, it had to come home with me. 50 cents. I picked up these boots for me. These are very nice boots. Very, very nice boots. And let me see if I can show you the inside of them. And it's just a basic edition. And it says it's a size seven and a half wide. I like them. I tried them on already. And they're just a, the nice brown color boots. So I thought these would be very cute for the winter. Look like nobody wore them right much. It was just very lightly worn. So I'm going to go ahead and get these all cleaned up. And put these disinfected and clean them and put them in my closet. So yes. A great great deal next thing I found was this beautiful top they actually had two of these tops in there and I wanted them and luckily I seen the first one before I seen this one and the first one was a um, extra large and then when I went around and seen this one that was a 1x I had to get this and the shirts in there are four dollars and fifty nine cent unless you do a dollar day um, this item right here was not on the dollar day. It was just that I liked it so much. Look at the colors. How pretty is that? It has this elastic waistband. How huh, it goes with my pants I have on right now, huh? I just thought that this was very pretty. I love this sequence detailing in it. We can see that. It has these sheer sleeves with the little elastic in it. Very, very, very pretty. Loved it. Loved it. And I knew if I didn't get it, it was not going to be there the next time I went back. So I picked it up. I went ahead and picked up these pajamas. I think these are pajamas. And the pajamas, for the, they count as one set. And the set will be um, $3.99, I think, or $4.99. I think it's $4.99. I'm trying to see the inside. I don't see a tag on here. But I went ahead and picked up this. It's a tie-dyed um, shirt. It's super, super cute. It's very, very soft. It says a size medium. I had to get it. I wanted it. And see, the pants is a medium. So I think I picked this up for my son's girlfriend for her. But yeah, look at that. How cute is that? And these are the pants to go with it. And there are this the cuffed at the bottom. Can you see that cuff? Has this cuff at the bottom. Like joggers, maybe you could say. But it's just the cuff at the bottom. And they're just the long waisted pants. And these are very, very soft. So I picked up those two items there. I got y'all on a roller coaster, huh? I'm just shaking y'all over the world. Can you say, Donna, stop shaking us so we can see? I'm getting dizzy. Next thing I picked up was these little, uh, what do they call Trolls? Troll um, headband. It's a troll. And you press the button here. You see that? It lights up. And it's just from the little movie Trolls. So it was 50 cents. So I thought that was very cute. So I picked that up. I picked this little outfit up right here. The whole little outfit. It's the pants and the shirt. It's a one piece set. And it's 24 months. And it just says love. And that's the shirt. 
and it has the pants under it, which is just a little jogging suit. See the pants stuck out the top. And they had this in the baby band. You see it's new from Rose's. It still has the tag attached to it. Somebody told the price off, but you can see it came from Rose's. But yeah, this was in the bin for 50 cent. Not 50 cent a piece, 50 cent for both pieces. Same thing as this here. This was um a unit, so they counted as one piece. So whatever the price is, it's just one price, not two, not for each individual. I picked up this plate. Um, this plate was 20 cent. It just shows you your portions. You got your vegetables and fruit. You got your grains and your proteins. And then in the very center is fats. It says real appeal. So I did pick this plate up. Um, I thought it was very nice. And let me see. It says, this is not for microwavable use. Dishwasher safe on top rack only. So yeah, I picked this up. I wanted to have that. It just shows you your, your portions that you can have. We have a bin in the store. It has just miscellaneous like t-shirts and different things and swimsuit tops. And everything in that bin is a dollar. And they also have another bin that has like domestic stuff in it like sheets and towels and certain comforters. It's a dollar. These t-shirts and scarves and gloves and different things, swimsuit tops, are a dollar. Same thing as the baby bin. They have a bin with just baby stuff in it from newborn up until uh, 24 months is 50 cent then they have all the toys in a bin that's 50 cent so i got this beautiful swimsuit top it's just that turquoise and blue i liked it so i picked that up i thought it was very cute it has the adjustable straps here the built-in bra and i thought that this would be great for next year um, and some things i am wearing a 16 18 but i'm sure this is not because swimsuits do fit tighter so this will be a good find for next summer. And all I got to do is buy me um, some bottoms to go with it. Which I don't want anyone else's bottoms where they had their butt in it. But I will do the, the bra and the boobs which is not bad. But the other part is a little too personal for me. Because it's too, too close to skin with no panties. No, no. I picked up this top. Love it. Love it. Love it. It's still brand new. It's from Kato's. 1820 regular 21.99 and they clearanced it for 15.99 somebody bought it never wore it but guess who's gonna get to wear it now as their new top yes me pretty butterfly donna i will be wearing this and it has this elastic at the bottom with this little ruffled detailing at the bottom so yeah that is very very cute and it is like a very see-through um like gauze material shirt it has this little elastic on the sleeves that's very thin and dainty. So, and it has this little tie here at the front with the little um, detail here on the front. But it's just a, a, a faded, like, light blue denim. So, I got that for me. And, um, like I said, it was, I think, I'm going to look at my, let me see what color of the week was I own in this bag. Let's see. Yeah, these was a dollar, so. If you see, I got a lot, right many things, it's a dollar. If you see the red hang tag, means it was a dollar. So I got that for a dollar. The swimsuit top was a dollar. I got these rust looking pants. Size extra large. And see, it has the red hang tag. It was a Sunday sale. Means I got it for a dollar. These were size 22. I'm thinking these might be a little big in the waist, but I will take them up. I know how to sew, so I will take these in in the waist. So that they could fit to like a 20 or 18 for me but i love the color and for a dollar they had to come home with me and if the legs is a little big i will take the legs up but i don't prefer to have to do that now because i were, was doing that when i was on um, before i started buying some clothes but i did like this so much that i didn't want to get this color for a dollar i will make it work for a minute so yes i will fix that and it will become mine I got this beautiful shirt. I got some green pants. If you watch some of my other hauls, um, I already hauled these green pants and some black ones as well. There's the front. I'm holding this phone in the other hand. And it's Isabel Rodriguez. And it's an extra large. You see the red hang tag there. I was letting you know that I got this for one buck because it was the color of the week. On Sunday, it was a dollar. So I got this. And it just has this little hang down neck like the little cow neck that hangs down low and this would be nice even though it feels flimsy 
and it is short sleeves i still will wear this for the winter but i have a winter shell that i will put this under here to make it thicker and then of course you know you have your coat on so yeah i thought that was very cute and it, you can see it has that little detailing on the side there so beautiful 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 i've been finding some great things at the goodwill great great things i thought this was cute because he plays some kind of music. Um, it's a little doggy with the headphones on. Um, you put batteries in here. So I'm going to take it loose and put some batteries in here. And see what he does. But I can't wait to see. I thought he was darling. He was 50 cent in the toy bin. And I got this colander. Which is a mess. It's a strainer. You can see there. I got it for $1.49. A dollar forty nine, and all you do is push this in, and pop, it pops out for you to strain your food. I'm doing this with one hand, y'all. Bear with me. Yep, and there you are. Ta da! There's your strainer. And then when you want to store, you just smush it back down, pop it back in, and put it up. So I thought that was cute, and I wanted to have it. And the last thing that I got was a Rubik's Cube. I know y'all remember this is an old school 80s toy, I think, if I'm mistaken. But I picked this up. I thought it was cute. This to pass the time with, this to play. Um, somebody's child had it, so I will be trying to, to wipe it off and make its marker on it. But it is a Rubik's Cube. How many of y'all was able to get the whole thing completely covered? Like all the orange, all the red, all the blue, all the white, all the yellow, all the green. How many was y'all able to do all of it? The complete thing. Not just one side or two sides. The whole cube completely done. Never have I ever been able to do it. But I just thought I like. I did love Rubik's Cubes. Always been one of my favorites. So I just picked up one of these. Thought I would give it a whirl. See what I could do with it. But as always. I know I took a lot of time talking to y'all about all my finds from the Goodwill. Hope you had some luck. Please go in and check it out. See what you find at your local Goodwill. Until next time, I hope everyone continues to be safe and have a blessed day. And as always, this is Pretty Butterfly. Bye. Peace.